please. Nothing dramatic. I did everything for this man. I gave him my life for 13 months. I went to stupid hockey games with him. I went to cheap and sordid motels. I lost weight for him. And how does he repay me? I give up. He went back to his wife. Is there anything to eat here? Where? Hold it one minute. Did you already eat? Twice. I'm not gonna let you do this to yourself. You've lost 25 pounds in the last four months. I'm not about to watch you put it back on in one night. But I am depressed. You always eat when you get depressed, and then you get depressed because you ate, and then you eat again. For you know you'll be back in queen size pantyhose. <sighs> At least I'm not an alcoholic. Don't attack me because you're upset. That isn't an apple juice, is it? Don't start. It was perfectly fine before you got home. Mm -hmm. Fine, maybe I will leave. Fine, leave. Fine, I will. Fine, go. OK, fine. Sorry. sorry. I hope he has a stroke, the son of a bitch. There is nothing to eat here. What happened to all the food? You were supposed to go to the store today, right? I was. Are you drunk? Get in there. Wonderful. My whole life explodes into my face. And the one night I need someone to lean on and to tell my troubles to, you decide to fall apart. I'm not falling apart. I'm not falling apart! And what do you mean the one night you need me to tell your troubles to? What the hell else do we do here seven nights a week? God help me if I ever have a problem and need your help. You are the the most together person I know. You never have problems, that's disgusting. Just because I don't run around telling the world I've got problems doesn't mean I don't have problems. I have problems. Oh. Do we have a little problem tonight? Don't talk to me like that. Like what? Like I'm on romper room and I just wet my pants. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just want you to know, if you have problem, I am here to listen. You wanna lay down on the couch? Let me get some paper. I'll take notes. Forget it. I will listen. Forget it! Please. Julie. I yelled at Mr. Plotkin tonight. He called up about the music and I... I called him an old fuck fart. Oh my God. I don't even know what a fuck fart is. I like this. Old fucked fart Plotkin. I always wanted to call him something like that, but I was afraid he would have a stroke or something. <laughs> I took my shirt off and exposed myself. For Plotkin? Yeah. <laughs> and what did he do? I think he had a stroke. I don't know. <laughs> I think he stopped breathing. I don't know. He'll get over it. 